Hello again. Good morning. So, doing something a bit different today, or different location. Um, so I'm riding on my own, and um, people I normally ride with, or I've been riding with, uh, it tends to draw me to the peaks, Ebden Bridge, Warncliffe, Lake District. So I decided today to come to North Wales, whilst I'm on my own, and it's within reach for me. So um, I'm having an exploratory around um, Langocklin. Um, only decided to do it this morning, so I didn't really do any research. I know there's some decent trails here. My original plan was to um, do one giant leap, uh, but unfortunately, sod's law, it's closed for the morning. So uh, it was opening at 12, but I thought, well, I need to get a bit of riding in. So um, <clears throat> some enduro trails kind of next door-ish um, so I've driven around there just done a hell of a climb um, two and a half miles straight out the, uh, out the car if you like uh, 900 feet of climbing so I'm not sure how many of them I've got in mid today uh, but we'll see how we go so yeah I mean uh, you can see we've got some uh, stunning scenery sunshine happy days so um, this is where the, some of the trails start, apparently, going to Mistrava, so I'll have a, I'll have a go down here and uh, see how we go. Cheers. See you on the trails. Right, rolling. No idea what to expect down here. There's uh, tyre tracks on it, so that's a good sign for starters. But it'll knock me shock. Might help. Right. Okay. Let's see what we got. Bit of a traverse at the minute. I think it does get steeper. Oh, I hope it does. Oh, that's too now. Gym and tonic or enduro? Let's try enduro. Enduro. Seems to be more up than down at the moment. <sighs> Not gonna bust a butt along here. I have to do a climb like that a few times. Oh. <sighs> yeah, my saddle too high then, so I couldn't really control the bike when it kicked me one, one way. Not roots on here. <coughs> Slipper. Okay, oh, no. I think I'll ride them next, next time if I come this way. 
Some of them we just got to lift your bike over the, the roots because otherwise they'll have you off. Hmm. I'm presuming we'll go down. Looks quite steep off that lip. Hmm, probably go that. Just looks a bit daunting. And it is quite wet. And you've got to avoid that tree, second tree. And give it a go, I think. Have a look up here, see what's up here. Out of interest, I might just do the push up back or something. Just managed it, pretty steep off that lip, really. Yeah, all right if it weren't for all these roots. Bit like lady by the last week, this. <laughs> Not keen on right on turns, I've got to be honest. Definitely think this would ride better in the uh, dry. That's just like Route Central, that is. I suppose in the drive, you had some speed, you hit it here, you could unweight the bike and probably clear them routes, but riding it blind and it is a bit soggy at the moment. And I'm on my own, which uh, doesn't help in case anything was to happen. So it's like full commitment, this next one. Probably better on the inside line, really, on that. Then you can go wide on the corner. Because this is like a steep drop in. <laughs>
Hmm. I'd like to be able to ride this at speed, but I don't think it's will be happening today. First push of the dirt, down out. It's pretty soft on them uh, burns, which I know I'm making excuses, but I don't really want to go off the edge. I have a needle stuff in it. <laughs> yeah, we'll go, but not for me today. So when I looked on Strava last night, just having a look around and see where to go on that. I had a look around here and uh, on these trails there's only two people ridden them this year and now I'm kind of working out why. It's not a bad bit. Down here. Probably down. That looks like it's the end of the other trail, probably uh, Gym and Tonic or whatever it was called. Carry on along here, see where we get to. It's probably double that. Somebody better than me in there. <laughs> That's quite uh, good, all you know. I know we say this a lot, those bike riders, but. It'll definitely uh, ride better in the dry and you think, well, I'll do that, I'll do that, I'll do that, so it may all be rideable. I'm kind of guessing this is the push-up back to the top. 
bit messy. Didn't expect dry trails today. Um, it's not rained, well, don't think it's rained anyway, might as well rain here, but not rained our way yesterday and uh, quite mild actually on the Saturday. So I have to dry the trails out a little bit, but it's still uh, very soft on the loamy bits. Like I was saying before on them corners, some of the berms they just weren't holding up very well. So get to the top and do something else. Cheers. So that's where I've just come down. Whether you can uh, ascertain how steep it looks from the camera because I know it flattens everything out. It was pretty steep in places. You can see from here it looks, well it looks to me, to be uh, yeah, hellishly steep. So yeah, that's uh, all part of my excuses or reasons for not doing as well as I did. But we'll have another go. Right, found another trail. Top of that push up, but I don't know if that was a push up to be honest. This is a trail going off in a different direction. Looks quite steep, so let's see how this one goes. How much pushing I do down. bad this actually covered in stone need a bit more speed on that take the corner a bit wider so think about riding stuff blind isn't it you don't know what's coming Well, it was all right. It's quite dark in here, eh? In fact, it's very dark. Hopefully, my shades will adjust in a minute. Thought I was going to get the front wheel that route. It's a bit more rideable than that last one for me. Something else coming out there. Don't seem to go any lower. Well, not round there anyway. So I think I'll go back up, see if I can find this one. Cool. Yeah.
track stand then. Very nice, I was. Have you done this one yet? No, I've not been any lower down, to be honest. Uh, it's a pain getting back up from it. Is it? Yeah. Right. So you end up right down the A5 there. Right, okay. Well, um, what's the best way up from there then? Up that, I did that time at climb that it's like a two mile climb or something, which is where I parked um, down that end. I don't know if you know it that well, but it was a time at climb coming back up here. All right, I didn't see this one. Yeah, it was all right, back again. So I've done quite a few trails on the other side, two or three. Uh, met up with a guy, I think as I said his name was Seb. Um, runs the website Roots and Rain. So that's uh, pretty interesting. The uh, racing site where you get all your pictures from and all that, which I've had before in the uh, dim and distant past. So there's a couple more trails on this side I've not done. I'll do this one here. I think it's about three trees or something. Three trees. Um, so we'll see where that brings me out. Loop back round and go again. See you shortly. Okay. <coughs> We've gone two lines. Oh, that was a gap. <laughs> it's handy if you know these things. Yeah, the contour lines looked like it was a bit steep, so we'll see. Quite tight. Whoa. Could have done that. Harry, bro. <clears throat> Does look a bit nasty, but it'll go. Well, hopefully. go flying through that <clears throat> really because I'm fairly dry at the moment maybe I'll come on the wrong track to be dry because there's a bit of a stream running down here no man
I don't mind riding on something like this. Hmm, I don't know if that's a gap, it might be. So I think I'll chicken out to that one. Yeah, a bit of a gap. Front wheel went. See there where it slid. <laughs> that caught me by surprise. Okay now. Nearly had me off. Or kind of half had me off. Right. Crack on. Yeah, there's a bit of grip on here. Compared to that Enduro line. Still fairly steep. Watch the uh, muddy puddles. That's all fucking caked in mud. Oh, oh bugger. Bit of drainage on here, won't go amiss. Ambitious trying to start this from here. Front wheel nearly went off the end, but nice to hold on to it. Quite a nice track, this. Like I say, in summer, we're running mint. Baggy mud as well. <laughs> okay now. That's quite clean and dry before this trail. Good grief. This is a mud bath. It was nice at the top. Nice and grippy. All good things, must come to an end. <laughs> More speed required. Riding, no other excuses. Oh, God, wrong gear. I suppose that's supposed to be a gap, is it? Give that another go. Oh. Shows you how steep it is. Oh. A bit of weight on my bike now with this mud. Right, let's see if I can line myself up better for this. Wow. 
I suppose I did it to a fashion. <laughs> Better than the uh, first attempt, that's for sure. I don't know if this is a continuation of the trail or what. Looks like it. Don't really want to go all the way down. Maybe I have no choice. I am now. This is that push up again. I'm kind of running out of trails now, it seems. But I don't mind. It's like time is it? I have to, and uh, I could do with a shortened day anyway. So there's two more I know I need to do that I've not done. Sorry, <laughs> which is this one, which is gym and tonic, and then another one that takes you all the way down to the road that I've no idea what its name is. And I can poodle back to the car. I don't think anybody's been down here today by the looks of that. White in the back, huh? I don't white in it. Oh, so far, huh? not too bad. Hmm. That's a big step down. Looks all right. Go back and do it. Took me by surprise, that did. Top if I could get on my bike. Okay now. <laughs> Dear me. Right. Let's have a go. Jesus. That was a uh, fucking out in your mouth stuff, that wasn't. Inside or outside? Let's 
Try this line. Help me. That's quite for long. Looks like a few people have done that. Oh, I'm back on this again. Good hell. <laughs> Why do you do that? You muppet. <laughs> this is fucking steep. <laughs> ah, I've done it before, so I'm gonna have to do it again. <laughs> I don't know what happened then. I think I kind of panicked a bit. <sighs> right. Come on. You got this. Fuck oh, now. <laughs> to be honest, I wasn't feeling good about that. Although I rode it before without a dab. I don't know what it was. But, anyway, I'm down now. Oh, beautiful now. The sun's just gone in for a second, but very nice. So I'm going this way, cheers. Then that's a split, hopefully not. So this is one I was on this morning with the uh, Roots and Rain guy. Oh, there's a split on it somewhere. And I need to go left. Well, hopefully that wasn't the split, but you never know. Pretty hesitating again. So that could have been the split actually. So I don't think you come this far down. I'll go back and have a look. So I think is it this is where it split higher up. I was just wondering if this was a push up as opposed to a a trail down, but looks like it could be a trail down. Yeah. I knew I wasn't going to get that corner. <laughs> oh, so a fresh track this, looks it.
All right, this will take me down to the road apparently. So, let's see what we get on this. It's supposed to be quite steep at the end. I don't think this is the end. branch come on fucking hell got my pedals all wrong you yeah, fucker How many times have I been back up and tried again? Right. If at first you don't succeed, then bottle it. So we get my juice. Oh dear. Right. get that corner you're over the bars so fuck it It's not steep this, I'm just trying to get my balance. Looking at that petrol can or whatever it is, distracting me. Probably will roll that. <laughs> it's great, though, isn't it? When you don't know what's coming, how big it is. I thought that was a, a sender because it's quite a bit of mud after it, but it should roll. Is that the uh, Wait off the suspension though, to make sure I didn't hit the bash guard and send me over top. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> Jesus. It's not too bad, but it just kind of took me by surprise, is what I would say. Okay, now, can't get straight now. Oh, 
you know. A bit of a survival trail, this. Looks familiar, this, for some reason. So, all in all, was a decent day. The climbs back up did get a bit monotonous, to be honest, but I'm, uh, I'm on a shortened day anyway, so suits me. I think I've done pretty much everything that's here, from what I can gather. There might be one I've not done or something, but yeah, I'll come here again. I think I need to come back in drier conditions just to ride some of that shit that I've not rode today. Especially that uh, first trail that I did, which seemed to be the most difficult trail of the day, the Enduro Trail. So, yeah, happy days, new location, new trails, nice one. Cheers.